I'm in California for a couple days and my boy Serge just finished his K-swapped Toyota Tacoma so I had to pop in and check it out because doing over here. He's like a bear, he's just scratching his back on the floor. Oh, you're actually vlogging, I'm so proud of you. <laughs> Look guys, for the record, I hope this video comes out first. I got my intercooler on before it hurt did. <laughs> <missing. laughs> Yo, this truck is so good. Put the tools down. Come hang out with us. I, I'm taking a damn nap. Come. I, I, oh, I, you been? You been? <laughs> <laughs> Come take, on. I gotta take a damn nap. Aye, aye, aye. Big Sergi. Aye. <laughs> <laughs> <Say> aye. <laughs> Yo. So if you don't remember, Serge is my guy. He's helped me with countless projects, done a lot of fabrication for me. It's pretty much all last minute with me. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let me just apologize yeah, now. That's I, that's I apologize. <laughs> But he helped me with the Simple Sea Time Stallion, he's helped me with the GS, he's helped me with the Corolla, he's helped me with a bunch of different projects, and I've always seen his truck just chilling in the background. Well, the last few years, I mean, pretty much since I've been working on your stuff, it's been like in and out of shops, yeah. pretty much stacking parts for the swap and stuff. But it's always been, it's always been slammed, it's always looked like an X-Runner, you've done something a little different now. Yep, yep. So it's looked this way probably for like five years. Oh, look who decided to join us. Yeah, I, I love this truck, I can't not be involved. Oh. This truck is sick. Serge has put like 400,000 miles on this truck. Before it was like what it is now, it was like my daily just travel truck, you know? It's like my snowboarding truck pretty much. But yeah, now it's graduated, gradually. <laughs> graduated? Damn, Serge. I don't know if this is graduated. Yeah, this is like, <laughs> opened up a business. That's the principal, he's the yeah, dean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he's taking me to K school. Right now, I remember you always like, oh, I want to put a Jay-Z in it. And then we started doing my case swap yep, stuff. Yep. And I saw your brain turning and then I'm a bad influence. So I was just like, just save half the price. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And do a case swap. Half the price, half the weight, yeah. half the everything pretty much. But like same power. Serge recently got a video that went super viral. And everyone just keeps asking, why not build the stock motor? Why'd you put a K in this? Um, so the, the stock motor, it wouldn't, I would have, I would have spent like 10,000 just building the motor and then I would have had to still spend like 10,000 on all the parts and shit so whereas you just spent 10,000 once and yep. you have five 500 horsepower exactly is that what you made I, I'm just assuming yeah, yeah it was about 500 uh it was 460 well, it was 500 then we turned it down to 460 so that's where it's at right now is this a built motor or a stock 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 uh, JDM California motor shout out to JDM California man they got all the gold yeah, yeah they, hooked, they hooked it up um I feel like I remember you saying you were going to build the motor yeah, so I have a built motor coming, and it'll, uh, <laughs> once that comes, we'll like, I think we'll like maybe turn it up a little all or right, something. Right. But for now, this is like, this is. I mean, it's. The tester. I drove my car at 420, 450, somewhere around there, for a good year and a half before 
yep. I had any issues. That, that's so, kind of what I want. I want like a, I want a daily. But at the same time, my usage is double any normal person's usage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah your, foot, your foot's heavier than the normal foot too. So I think you're gonna have a really good time with this. Yep. So bone stock K24. That looks like a plasma man. Yep, plasma man, uh, intake manifold. Oh, drive by yep. wire too. Yep, yep. My God, yeah, the, the taco's dog. like, uh, it, it somehow morphed into like this, this, you, this. Obviously, you, you probably run a Haltech, right? Yeah, Haltech. I uh, think you can tune cruise control into this. Yep, yep. That'd be sick. That'd Yo, be sick. You I can talk so, to Andrew. Yeah, sure. so you can still do your road trips, cruise control yep. with a 500 horsepower K-swap. Dang, man. That's that's the goal. I want to, I want to like, that's, I want to road trip it out this, Yo, this I see, summer. This I spring. see the AC compressor still there. Yep. Does yep. it work? Uh, I have to finish this line. Okay. It goes to the, the front of the compressor. Yeah. And after that, like, it'll be good to go. Yo, you yep. ain't playing, Serge. Yep. But the whole swap revolved around, like, keeping AC. Creature comfort. Yeah, there's no way. There's no way. Bro, this is, I mean, it, this looks pretty natural in here. And that's a Gary, what is that, a G30 or? G30. 770? Uh, 660. Oh, oh 660. Yeah, oh, so yeah, you yeah. zoot it. Yep, yep. I had a, a G25, I sold that, and then uh, just went to the G30. Dang, man. And you just made this this morning. Yeah, I made the intake <laughs> this morning. Uh, the, this this whole pipe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had it down to like the front of the bumper, but it was it was rubbing at like full uh, off, so this is gonna be Yeah, cause you got now. some Johns on this thing. Yep, but yep. Nice little tight pipe. I see you dabbling in a titanium. Yep, That's my yep. boy, man, I, I love this. This, I, I can't explain how happy this makes me. Like, I seen Jolly posting about it, and I was so stoked. I admire you as a person, because you, there are not many people in this industry who just have an uh, unconditionally good heart and want to help everyone. Right, thank, and so... Yo, oh, so, that's like oh, goosebumps yeah. in here, man. <laughs> that's real. It, it's real. It's yeah. real. And so to see you finally get to enjoy, you know, your dreams and do your things instead of helping other people achieve theirs just makes me so happy. So... I'm fucking stoked for yeah. you, Serge. We took it on its maiden voyage yesterday. Yeah. And I was like, yeah. yeah, let's go. His passion for this truck is unmatched. Yeah. I mean, you just. <laughs> Why do I want a Tacoma right now? This yeah. is kind of jump started your career, no? Uh, yeah, like, yeah. Trying so like, like fab and stuff. When I started, uh, so it has S14 rear subframe on like cantilevers and stuff. And when I first did that, that kind of like helped promote like my just brush over of, cantilevers of, <laughs> well let, let's take a step back what year is this truck so it's a 07 with a 2015 like front end ah, so it's like this, so you change the headlights the hood and then the grill it's kind of like a zenki koki type of right type of, type of swap your truck wasn't an x-runner no no so it's a just x-runner kit and they just like shortened it pretty much to X, fit yeah x-run has only came in an extended cab oh so interesting they, they had to take like a couple feet out so, so that yeah, so uh, that's probably why this thing looks so cool too. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> I, I, I feel like I've never really looked at these and thought. I, I like X runners. I think they're cool, but something about this one always yeah. spoke to me. And, Single cabs. And now I, now I get it. Yo, that's cool, man. What, what inspired you to start with the Tacoma as your platform? Like, did you just have it as your daily, and then you're like, I'm gonna just build this? Pretty much, yeah. I had a, I had it as a daily, and I was like, basically, like financially, I was just stuck with it. <laughs> so I was just like. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with this. You that, know? That's my favorite part about yep. cars, man. Run with you, bro. Yep. Yep. You know, you got what you got, you're gonna make it work, and then you end up in a place like this. Well, I used to live up in Big Bear, and like, I used to try to chase my friends up the mountains. Dude, they, I wouldn't, <laughs> obviously wouldn't do shit, but like, I'd always be like, one day. One day, <laughs> hey, you know, we're gonna today's the day. Yeah. <laughs> now we can run about it. Sure. I got time today. <laughs> 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 Yo, this is so cool. So, was this truck originally manual? Uh, it's been auto. It was automatic. Yeah, I car just looks so cool. I just always assumed it was yeah, manual. I, I drifted it. We had like a little uh, like thirty shot of Nas yeah. on the stock motor, yeah. and we drifted it. It's fine. It, yeah. It, it, what did you do for a clutch pedal and stuff? Uh, clutch pedal. I just used the stock like five speed. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can check it out. It's like a stock five speed. You even got the door beep. Yeah. Still got yep. the door beep. Yep. Dude, this car. This truck is plush, man. So that's a OEM Tacoma clutch pedal? Yep, OEM clutch pedal. Dang, that makes it easy. Uh, OEM, that's actually like the OEM drive-by-wire pedal too. So oh, wow. They just wired it to, to that. Oh, so the truck was already drive-by-wire yeah, too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, dang. So the, the wires were pretty much there. They just like added a, a little a plug to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The TF4 shifter? Yep, yep. The handbrake's always been there or you just put uh, that in so there too? It's that OMD. Uh, it's like a part shop max base with like a Martin spec. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, OMD spec. He makes it. Obviously, you got the... Don't worry, B Hashy, J Town, yep, yep. Uh, NRG steering wheel. 
That's what's in my 240 right now. Yep, I saw yeah. I saw someone post a picture the other day. I yeah. saw it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's been in there. I just haven't used the car. Yeah, yeah. I took the car out once and caught on fire. So. No, we gonna talk it's about it. Here. I think at this point the, that video is already out. So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, but dang, man, that's crazy. Yeah, with the Yeah, with the buckets in this bad boy. Man, that's sick. It's super comfortable. And oh, he got a fuel. Oh, yes. You got all the juice back here. Yeah, it's a new, a new performance fuel cell, and then uh, yeah, the canyon lovers. Uh, what made you want to do that? Is that because you were getting smoked in the canyons? Well, exactly, like the solid axle in the canyons is like not really right. good to jam, you know. So yeah, I went to this, and I had to get more leverage out of the coilovers. So I like went coiled with cantilever. So that's basically right. it. Like, oh, that's what inspired you. So you had the coils. Yeah, I had them for like basically free. So I was like, I gotta just figure out. I started looking into cantilever, and basically, you get more leverage out of the arm versus like what goes to the coil. Right. Or whatever, it's like you know? a multiplier kind of. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. It's like a pulley. Yeah, it's pretty tight. It's pretty tight. Uh, it handles so yeah. good. Just woof, woof. So, man, ugh. dude, I love this truck. Mm. Would you just look at it? Here, put sole pods on his truck, yeah, man. yeah, straight up Johnny's on this bad boy. Yeah. Are these 19s, uh, 19s, yeah. Dang. so it's like a seven inch lip, seven and a half inch lip. Oh, my goodness, under, yeah, you build different 19 by 10 and a half. It's a seven and a half inch lip, and then I run a seven and a half yeah. inch lip, so it's a seven and a half inch lip, and then I run a three inch lip as a barrel. It's like not wow. recommended, but but they but were you like, gangster. they were like, yo, don't do that, like, you're gonna deep bead. I've been on this setup for like four years, right. five years. I've never beat it once. Oh, like, and of course you have dual caliper brackets yeah, because yeah. this is a, a 240. Basically, <laughs> basically, what's crazy too is it, it runs. It's the exact same like version of my S14, like same sub. Oh God, same we have dual even, caliper. I feel like not enough people have seen your S14 <laughs> too. Yeah. This dude has absolutely one of the baddest S14s on the planet. SR, fully built. Just, we'll, we'll hopefully we run a track day with him with that thing one day, but. Serge don't play. Look at his daily. Yeah, even even daily's hard. Yeah. What what size are the front wheels? Uh, same, uh 18, 19 by ten and a half. Oh, so it's square. <laughs> yeah, yeah, squared. But so the front's plus twenty two and the rear is uh, negative sixty nine. Wow. <laughs> that's, that's real shit. That's real no shit. Way. I make no that up. way. No way. <laughs> <laughs> pull the ruler out like negative sixty nine. Sorry. You want us to pull the ruler out to measure your sixty nine? <laughs> 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 Yo, so yeah, so I'm, I'm in California for a couple of days. I've just been super stoked that my boy Serge finished his, his project. He's been working on this for so long. And so I figured, you know, I'm going to go, I'm going to go check it out. I want to see how happy it makes him. I think I just want to dabble a little bit and kind of bring it back the OG built breakdown vibes and just sharing cars that I love with you guys. This is a car or a truck that I love. A lot of people have been hitting me up like, it's not even a truck anymore. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah it's a car now. Dude, this is so good, man. It's like a truck that identifies us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that you whispered it. Why'd you whisper it, Serge? Right. <laughs> Serge, <laughs> out of control, man. This is so good, man. I love this. Yeah, you made the mounts? Yeah, made the motor mounts. So I used like LS, uh, LS motor mounts. They, they fit. You just got to like kind of play with them a little right right uh, they were like 45 bucks bmw transmission the yep. standard the yep. k-swap transmission yep. yeah. oh you made your own oil pan too huh yeah so that's a stock aluminum oil pan uh i notched the front section out and then i just uh threw like a front wheel drive baffle in there okay and it, just letting it eat it's been that's been, been chilling all right. that's why i want to run this for a little well we check like oil pressure and shit before before you put a built motor exactly, in so exactly. run this thing through the ringer see how it takes yep, it yep. it's been good i've been i've probably done 100 donuts in yeah, like the yeah. last like Shit, you want, you, know? you want to do one more? Yep, yep. Yeah. Dude, <laughs> nothing compares to his happiness when he drives this truck. <laughs> Dude, it's fucking real. It's crazy. It's because I've been like dreaming about it for like 10 years. Yeah. Like, so it's like the first five years were like the rear end. And then it was like kind of like five years of like making it look the way it looks. Yeah, I'm happy for you, Serge, man. Thank this you, is so cool. You. Yeah, I'm juiced. I'm juiced. You like like the kids are happy, my wife's happy. Everyone's like, "When are you gonna bring the taco yeah. home?" Like, I mean, this has been a part of your family yep, for yep, yep. over ten years, yep. right? Yep. We've had it since '07. So, Damn. like, oh, you you is, yo, are yo. you first owner? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're yeah, first yeah, yeah. owner well, of the truck yeah, too. Yep, yep. First owner. My, my wife was first owner, and then she graduated. She got another car, forgot about it, 
and then uh, she gave it to me. Instead. Dang! So shout out wifey! Yeah. Shout out to wifey! Yeah, that's kind of like the value too. Like she, like the sentimental value too. You know, she, she like gave it to me, and I was like, all right, dude, that's so that's cool, cool, man. That's super sick this morning. He was he was already driving this cross paths with Animal Style while you were still driving with him and didn't even know you at the time. 2014 ASB, I was driving this around, kind of how it is right now, just like lowered on rims. Yeah. With all the homies in the back, and uh, I drove past you and uh, Julian in his S14. Yeah. It was like red with the white lip. Yeah. And that expired my S14 build. Oh. You know, after that, I was like. Oh, that. Yeah. Bro, that tells a huge story because exactly. your car is zinky, slammed on its nuts. Exactly. Yo, like, it's, that's what I wanted for. I was like, I want that. Dude, I that, want that. Yep, yep. Man, I just love how energy does things. 2014, that happened, and now it's one of my best friends. Yeah, you know? yeah. Like, that's that's crazy. All because we like dumb cars. That's <laughs> <laughs> it's so cool. It's tight. It's tight. I'm happy for you, Serge. What? Are you underestimating his 500? I'm a big, I know I'm overestimating my size. <laughs> Serge, this is happening. <laughs> <laughs> this thing is hammered, bro. a certain age you get a quarter inch leeway yeah, yeah, yeah. all right man <laughs> serge thank you for the rips uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. thanks man uh, yeah. so good so fucking... <laughs> <laughs> fucking <taco. laughs> this thing feels great man it slammed on its nuts so all it does every time you move it, which makes it cool. <laughs> I'm happy for you, man. You just dragging body kit the whole that's time cool. doing donuts. That's kind of why I had the the under panels put on was like to save the body kit. I'll always. You, you just can't outbuild fabricators, man. Yeah. Like. <laughs> Even if you you're, you give them money to build your cars, they'll still build theirs cooler. There's nothing you can do about it. Because they took the experience from your car <laughs> and put it over there. <laughs> no, but that's, that's real shit. Everything I learned from your swap, like, fucking went into this shit. Oh, you know? man. Um, well, there you have it. Serge's 2007 Toyota Tacoma. Absolute beautiful machine. Built with love, passion, blood, sweat, and tears. Um, I love to see it. If you got a car that you want me to feature and you know me, hit me up. I'm down.
got the jitters. Bro. I could have, I could have resisted. I was like, I'm fucking going. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you came out cheesing. <laughs> any of your California friends? I miss all my California friends. I don't miss the place, I just miss my friends.